Welcome to Karish Tutorials. I'm Simeon Grace. I will be explaining how to insert goddess to your dress. This can be done in a skirt, either short or long, or a gown. So I'll be explaining how to insert the goddess. I'll be using two different materials to do this. If this is your first time watching this channel, kindly hit the subscribe button. Also click on the bell to get notifications for all our tutorials. <laughs> Alright, first thing I'm going to cut out my eight pieces dress. It can be a skirt, it can be in form of a gown. So the hip measurement is what I'm using to fold. The hip is 44 inches, and the length I'm using here is 43 plus 2 inches. I have 45. Alright, cutting out the eight pieces, it can be a skirt, it can be in form of a gown or anything. This is a dress, so the base is what I'm cutting out. The length is 43 inches. I have 2 inches added to it, so I have 45 inches. From the knee length, I have 24 inches plus my seam allowance. And from the waist, the hip measurement is what I'm folding with. The hip measurement is 44 inches. So divided by 8, 44 divided by, what I did is, I first divided the 44 into 2. That's 22 inches for front, 22 inches for the back. So divided by 4 inches, that's 4 inches to the front, 4 inches to the back. So plus my seam allowance, I have 3.5 inches. Just add your seam allowance. So the 3.5 inches come all the way to the knee length. Now folding with the base measurement, I have 7 inches here, 7 inches. So you can increase this depending on the width you want. So all I'm going to do is bring out my shape to join to the 3.5 inches and I'll cut it out. So I need 8 of this. I'm cutting this out, then I'll place this until I have eight pieces. So I have all the eight pieces. The next thing I'm going to cut is a goddess. And to achieve that, all I need to do is fold the triangle shape. The width of your folding depends on your choice. You can still fold something wider than this. All right, so the length from the knee is 24 inches. So here I'm going to add to it, so I'll just make it 26 inches. So I'll measure 26. All right, so, so this is just one. This is one, and I need eight of this. This is just one. I need eight of this, so I'll just continue to place this on my material to get all the heights. Alright, so I have all the heads, um, the heads got it. The next thing I'm going to do is place each to cut out lining. I'm going to cut lining for each of this and inserting it will be done in the sewing aspects. Welcome back. I have my lining placed on the triangle. So what I'm going to do is to turn each of these triangles with the lining. So I'm going to start with the base.
All right, so I'll continue with the side and leave little space so, I'll, so as to turn it inside out. Just repeat the same on each triangle. So the little space we left, there's need to close it up and I'll do just that. Alright, so I have my pieces to insert the goddess. I'm going to start by joining one side of the triangle to one side of my pieces. So I'll bring it to the end of the triangle. And also on the other hand, it's going to be another pieces of the um another pieces to the to one side of the triangle then I'll continue the joining So we have this. I'm going to repeat the same on the other side of the pieces. So I'll place my triangle on one side of this. Then the other side of the triangle, I'll pick one of my pieces and I'll join on one side.
all right so this is what we're going to have at the end this can be either on a short skirt a long skirt or a gown so don't forget to thumb up if you like this tutorial and if this is your first time watching this channel kindly click the subscribe button also hit the bell so as to get notifications for all our tutorials thanks for watching carries tutorials